Hey there. So uh, what you're about to see is very, very uncharacteristic of me. I am not a DIY nor a honeydew list or a uh, punch list or a, uh, you know, a handyman really at all. But uh, previous weeks I found a hack because we were going to buy new shutters or have them professionally painted because they were looking really dingy. But I found a hack. It works so far. This shutter right here I did about three weeks ago and it still looks really good. Of course it's not exposed to the element like some of the others. So uh, I'm not a professional. If you try this, you're trying this at your own risk, just like I did. So if I ruin your shutters by you doing this, then too bad. But uh, I've seen it. I, I found it on Facebook. So um, I'm sorry. Actually, I found it on YouTube. So anyway, my shutters look great. I'm happy with uh, with the results, and you can uh, save yourself. Oh, probably a whole lot of money if you simply do this with your shutters. It took me maybe an hour, hour and a half to do eight shutters, I guess. Two, four, yeah, eight shutters. That wasn't bad. So, anyway, check this out. I'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, what's going on? Um, Y'all are not going to believe this. I am on my roof. Okay. So, and I have discovered a way to uh, hack uh, cleaning the shutters rather than having the shutters replaced or having them painted. So, hang out. I'll be right back and I'll show you how this is done okay uh, actually you know what hold right there so what I've done first is uh, I've washed the shutters I've let them dry I'll, I'll show you those here in just a second but I want to show you some of the other tools mysteriously that will take care of cleaning the shutters and this should last for a few years um, and we'll see how it goes so first you need Yes, you got it. Armor all tire foam, baby. So, what you do is you clean the shutters really, really good with soapy water. Rinse them off with clean, clear water. Let them dry really good. And then uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to tape them off. And then after I tape them off, I'm going to spray them with the... Uh, tire foam cleaner and let that sit for about 20-30 oh, seconds maybe a minute or so I'm gonna wipe it really good with this baby diaper and um, should be good to go make sure uh, when you're taping it off you use a good thick uh, painters tape because you don't want it to get on the vinyl siding if it gets on the vinyl siding then you might as well go ahead and uh, armor all the whole house because it's gonna look like crap around the edges of the windows after that. So I'll be right back. I'll give you an update on how things are going. All right, so as you can see, <clears throat> I've got the shutters all taped off. Man, look how dingy they look. We're embarrassed. They're gonna look like new in just a little while. Check this out. So. I'll show you over here. Got these all taped off. These two here. All taped, so. All right, now to the fun part. Okay, so here we go. You're gonna apply this uh, just, just like you would on your tires, really. Make sure you get in the edges there, real good. 
Probably should have done it on the day that wasn't quite as windy, but whatever, we're getting it done. You're gonna love, absolutely love the results. Alright, so got the whole shutter. Double check a couple little spots. Make sure I got all the way down the edge over here. Get the top. Alright, so now all you want to do is get your diaper after this sits for a little while. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray the other side. I'll come back and I'll show you how to wipe that all down with the diaper, okay? So this is it. Sprayed everything down, let it sit for a good while. And now just wipe it with a diaper or whatever. Uh, you wanna make sure and get the, uh, the extra residue there. So that's it. So I'll wipe them all down and let you see what they look like. Thanks. And there's the finished shutter. Nice and clean.